Okay, so clearly I've made a bar magnet. It's magnetic. But what I want to do is put two poles in each side of that magnetic canceling that I was talking about. Alright, there is a trick to doing this. What you want to first do is charge the system regularly. Just act like this coil ain't even here. It'll charge up. But then what you want to do is switch your polarity on that side. Switch the polarity on the side that don't have the coil. Make sure y'all can see this. See how that dropped off? So now I got a south I really don't know what it is really kind of just moving around in there but I am it is energized so I'm gonna let off now and it'll move to back the way it was south okay, I'm gonna energize it once more Okay, while it's like that, I'm just going to pull it away. You know, there ain't nothing under the compass or nothing. Okay, I'm going to put it back. It's still hooked up the way it was with the one coil. Right in front of it. I'm going to disconnect it now. It's back the way it was. Show you again how it demagnetizes, it just loses its magnetism. It just loses its magnetism. It's kind of weird how it reacts. It's almost got like a mind of its own. Like you can tell this side has, see, I mean, you can see it actually follow to a pinpoint where it's at when it goes right here. I'll move this paper clip, make sure it ain't got nothing to do with it. All right, I'm going to disconnect it. I mean, you could tell that compass knows exactly where that pole is until I connect this coil, and it just loses it. Mm -hmm. And then just, you see it moving back and forth, not knowing exactly what's going on. I'm going to pull it away. Alright, I'm going to disconnect the coal. And it made a little difference. 